Welcome to Learn with Lily. Today we are starting with your Longman Business SST course book for class 4 students, chapter 15. And the name of the chapter is Water Resources of India. Guess the name. Deepest ocean in the world and the name starts with letter P. Pacific Ocean. Longest river in India and starts with letter D. Ganga. Three quarters of the Earth's surface is covered with water. Majority of this is in the oceans and seas. Water is one of the most important natural resources as life depends on it. All living things, animals, plants and human beings need water to survive. Water is used for various purposes like drinking, cooking, bathing, washing and cleaning. Sources of Water more than 70% of the earth is covered with water. Oceans, seas, rivers, lakes and ponds are important water bodies on the earth. Water is also found beneath the surface of the earth and is known as ground water. There is plenty of water on earth's surface. We still face water crisis. Some of the Reasons for shortage of water are as below. Most of the water found on the earth is not fit for drinking. The water in the oceans and seas are salty. Only about 3% of water found on the earth is fresh water. It is found in ponds, lakes, rivers and streams as well as under the ground. Rain is also an important source of fresh water. The farmers in India depend mostly on rain for irrigating their fields. However, rainfall occurs only for two or three months. Key terms. Fresh water means water that is not salty and irrigating means supplying water to grow crops. Also, Certain areas get very heavy rain while others get completely less or no rain at all. As you can see in this picture, it is river, a source of fresh water. And did you know the river Nile is the longest river in the world? Now sources of water for irrigation. First of all is wells. People in the villages dig wells to bring underground water to the surface for daily household activities. Tube wells. A tube well is a water well which has a tube or pipe fitted to the ground water source. An electric or diesel pump is used to pump water. The water is mainly used for drinking and irrigation. Persian wheel. It is a mechanical way of lifting water from open wells with the help of animals like buffaloes or camels. It is also used to irrigate the agricultural fields. Dams Dams are barriers constructed on rivers. They stop the flow of water, river water, and store it in a reservoir. Dams have many uses. They help in controlling floods in the rivers. Water stored in the Reservoir is used for irrigation. The water of the dam is also used to produce electricity and dams also help in the development of fishing and navigation. Therefore, dams are also known as multipurpose river valley projects. As you can see, this is the picture of a dam and now canals. Canals are small channels through which water from rivers or dams is diverted to the fields. They are dug to take water to regions where there is shortage of water. And reservoir means place where water is stored. For example, the Indra Gandhi Canal, also called the Rajasthan Canal, has been constructed for taking water to the desert areas of Rajasthan. It is the longest irrigation canal in the world. As you can see, this is the picture of a canal. 
and this table is talking about multipurpose river valley projects in India. Dam, state and river. You can see Bakranangal Dam is in the state of Punjab and on the river Sadlut. Nagarjuna Sagar, Andhra Pradesh and on the Krishna River. Faraka Barrage, West Bengal, Ganga River. Hirakud, Odisha, Mahanadi and Tehri, Uttarkhand, Bagirati River. Rainwater Harvesting Rainwater harvesting is the process of collecting and storing rainwater to be used later. This stored rainwater is then used for drinking, irrigation and so on. This is usually done in the areas where there is scarcity of water. Importance of water We all know that life cannot exist without water. We must not waste and pollute it at it is very precious. Of all the water available on the earth, only one person is fit for drinking. 22nd March is celebrated as the World Water Day every year. As you can see in this picture, what do you see in this picture? It is a tube well and how is it useful? You can refer to page number 90, the description about the tube wells. Now, recap. Water is an important natural resource. The main sources of water are rivers, seas, oceans and rain. Water should not be wasted as it is very precious. Now practice time. Choose the correct answer and fill in the blanks. Number 1. Ocean is the biggest source of water on the earth. Number 2. In cities, water reaches the houses through tap. Number 3. Lakes is not a source of fresh water. Mm. The answer is C, not lakes. The Hirakud Dam is, this, is in the state of Odisha. Answer the questions. We'll refer to the notebook now. True or false? Number one, the government should work alone to solve the water crisis. False. Number two, water is important only in desert. False. The longest irrigation canal of the world is in the USA. False. Wasting water is a good habit. False. And World Water Day is celebrated on 25th January. False. Now unscramble the words. Number one is river, then dam, then canal, then pump, and then terry. Think and answer we refer to the notebook and here solve the crossword with the help of the given clues. Number two, farmers in our country depend on it for irrigation, rain. Number three, source of underground water in village, well. And number one, source of fresh water is lake. Now, as you can see here, these are some sources of water. Well, sea, Persian wheel, ocean, canal, pond, dam, rain, stream, lake, tube well, and river. Now, answer the questions. Number one, why is water important for life? Answer, water is one of the most important natural resources as life depends on it. Number two, write three uses of water. Water is used for various purposes like drinking, cooking, bathing, washing, cleaning, and irrigation. Number three, write two uses of dams. The two uses of dams are, they help in controlling floods in the rivers and the water of dams is also used to generate electricity. Number four, what is the rainwater harvesting? Rainwater harvesting is the process of collecting and storing rainwater to be used later. The stored rainwater is then used for drinking, irrigation and so on. It is usually done in the areas where there is scarcity of water. Think and answer. Clean water is necessity. Do you agree? Why? Why not? Yes, clean water is a necessity because 
If we will drink dirty water, we will fall sick. And if we cook with dirty water, our food will also become dirty. So, if you enjoyed my video, please do like, share, subscribe. Thank you so much for watching. God bless you all.